uh, hey folks, we're going over my Vertex EDC pack. Really, really cool bag. I made an EDC pack video a while back. Really like that bag. I like this one even more. And uh, we'll go over kind of the whys. Uh, first and foremost, let's get to the good stuff. On the side here is this big quick pull tab right here. It dangles to my right as I'm chilling. And there I can rip it open, hold, and access a firearm really quickly. So I love that. This is what the compartment looks like from the side. And here are all my nice goodies. I'll go ahead and give you a real nice shot of it right here as the whole panel comes loose. All right, that's what the inside looks like. Uh, this is called Tactigami, and uh, Vertex makes this for your AR mags, whatever you want to put in there, a radio, pistol mags, flashlights, Leatherman tools, and you can custom form it to hold whatever you want. I like carrying this little 22 because America, and when you say, like, are you assassin? No, I just like carrying a silence 22 because I legally can. Right in here is where uh, you can put your body armor in here, just some uh, soft body armor, so that when I'm uh, running and gunning, this rotates in front of me and it acts as a shield. So I've got armor here and a gun here. So yay for that. Uh, lots of good cushioning right here, very comfortable. It holds through, so in an airport, the luggage rack can go through there, or the luggage handle, so that you can kind of cart it around easily. Start on a little bit there, cool. Or I can access it kind of like a shield as well. Uh, right in here, it's got something that can go around your waist, and I just don't want to let all the excess out, and I just stow it here because I'm normally not hiking anywhere with it, so it's just down and out of the way. Uh, this can go across your chest right here to keep it all tight. I do use that, so I like that. On the side, little compartments for water bottles. I've got a little tourniquet in there that I'm not so crazy about anymore, uh, but it's quick access there. I'm gonna put some uh, a cat uh, in the other side. Uh, the very first pouch right here, checkbook right in the rain and a bunch of business cards for me here pins good flashlight that just hooks in there uh, space blanket people are uh, people hit me up in my last EDC video I'm like why in the world because these things have saved my life over uh, across seas when you didn't have uh, the benefit of even having a backpack, put this in a cargo pocket, and when you're uh, down at night, this will uh, this has saved my life. I just went camping, and uh, I had an old tent, and all the seals failed on it, and it's just old. I should I should have brought one of my newer ones. Uh, but anyway, I put a space blanket over me, and that kept me uh, uh, dry and warm. Uh, this was just like a week ago, and if I hadn't had it, my whole sleeping bag would have gotten soaking wet. Electrical tape, cliff bar. Uh, some cordage and a bracelet with a whistle. Here's a bunch of batteries I just keep. And that does it for this pouch right here. You know, I've got bug out bags. An EDC pack is not a bug out bag. My bug out bag gets a little silly. And I say bug out bag, I should say bug out bags. Uh, and that's not what this is for. And I've got some survivalist type things in there but that's not what this is for this is me just tooling around town things I like and you're like would you ever need a space blanket probably not I just want one and I get to pick what's in my bag uh, so uh, for those of you who says that makes no sense I don't care it makes me sleep well at night uh, this is a real cool pouch right here just kind of rip off this is Vertex's uh, small accessory pouch and uh, right here I've just got a Leatherman tool folds over. Man, it is hot out here. This is a labor of love. You're welcome. Uh, chapstick. I use this to put over my uh, lights as well. So my uh, light right there, I rub a little chapstick on it and it keeps it from uh, getting all gunked up. This is uh, just some duct tape that I uh, 
folded over on itself so I got duct tape ready in addition to my electrical tape and that stores all nice and pretty in there this is a lapel mic for uh, doing videos for you guys I've got a lighter in there a USB stick a little miniature survival compass a passport card and that does it for this pouch and I can just stick it right on there. This is the large accessory pouch by Vertex. Pretty cool, and it's got all kinds of places to store stuff. It opens up like so. I've got a chem light. I haven't put anything in here yet, though I intend to. And this is my electronics. I've got a power hub right here. Thanks, Aimpoint. I've got uh, cords to charge all my goodies in there. I've got my headphones, I've got a car charger adapter, and a wall adapter. So uh, all kinds of little loops that you can put, knives, flashlights, uh, pins, chem lights, anything you want in there. And I just got this bag, more things that zip, and I just shoved this down in here, right there. This is a little miniature Vertex bag. I got this at SHOT Show or NRA Show, and it's just a nice little tiny bag that I can have on me as well. If I go to the beach or I'm going to work out at the gym, yes, I started working out again, guys. I'm coming online, so uh, that's good. I forgot to put this back in there. Awesome. It looks like this is a little carabiner type thing where you can hook it into the bag or daisy chain multi the, multiple of these together. Uh, right here's a little hook that I've got my um, 550 cord attached to right here. And it's a whole lot of it fed into the bag. And it's done like this because I uh, daisy chain it out right here. So it's all nice and together. But now I can pull this loop and I can get as much cord as I want. You're welcome. I just undid that and now I'm going to have to braid it back for you guys. So, uh, yeah, you're welcome. I was minorly inconvenienced for you. So, uh, <laughs> there you go. So there's that, that. We've already dealt with the side pouch here where I could get my firearms, spare magazines. And here's the main pouch right here. All right, and groovy. Uh, morale patches, this is just some uh, antiseptic type stuff, some, um, you know, whatever, pins, a more, uh, another Tactigami pouch that I just used for an extra Glock magazine in addition to the two I have on me. It's empty because I just shot. All right. Uh, shorts for working out. Uh, laptop cord hat, tripod, because I happen to make YouTube videos. All right, if you look in here, there's a little loop. So uh, if you put a camelback in there, you can loop this around the camelback handle right here. So the camelback doesn't fall down. And then it's got spots in here to run a camelback hose through and down here. So your camelback's all good to go. Uh, here I've got a 15 inch laptop that fits in there and it's got a sleeve right here so that I can hold it. My nice morale patches, yay. A uh, book that I'm reading on women Soviet snipers, pretty exciting. Uh, here I've got a medical kit, uh, tourniquet on the side, chem light on the side and all kinds of goodies in there, a poncho, and some uh, gloves for uh, fighting. There's also a pouch in here. I've just got more business cards in there at the moment. And uh, in there it's got uh, 
hook and pile tape uh, so that I can Velcro stuff in there. Hook and pile tape. I can't remember the term for Velcro. Hook and pile tape is a term that military guys use. Anyway, that's the bag. It does not weigh a lot, even with all this stuff in. Very comfortable. And when I was out running and gunning, all this stuff was in it. So I could stage it and make it all faster and cleaner if I uh, take all this stuff out. But even with a loaded down pack, I'm still able to access firearms, have my body armor and all my kit right here as it is. So I wanted to train realistically for you guys and shoot for you guys. So this is uh, really uh, the whole uh, deal. Uh, so anyway, my EDC pack by Vertex. If you want one, check in the description. I'll provide uh, handy links for you guys. And uh, it's like a big fat discount when you use my code. So I'll include a, a code below for you guys if y'all want to get these. Train hard, train smart, and uh, have good tools because it just makes life a lot easier and you'll feel like a cool guy. Uh, I like it because it's not all tactical type uh, uh, bag, so it um, doesn't look like I'm carrying a hundred guns in there. So uh, anyway, see you guys. Do -do 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 -do, just a normal guy walk in, except I have a silenced gun. And walking.